it's so nice because when Chrissy um, comes over and visits, you know, I constantly have to ask her, hey, 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 how do you sign fruit snacks? You know, <laughs> or hey, how would you sign goldfish crackers? Um, you know, and, and how would I sign that in a sentence, you know? Um, and so it's just, it becomes a really natural form of, you know, way of just, you know, knowing that and being able to, to teach that and give that to her. Our Deaf Mentor has, has helped Winnie and I in a number of ways. Uh, first of all, by coming into our home and interacting with our family in our place with our things and our toys. Um, Winnie has access to a deaf adult who signs with her, communicates with her, and interacts with her, and um, kind of becomes part of our life. One of the biggest things that I believe is like the convenience of them coming here and then sitting down in your home, being able to express what they know, teach you, and then help you grow with your family and then get to know them on a personal level. I think that's one of the biggest key things that I can take away from my the mentors that I've had is that convenience of them being here. That's my favorite part is having her actually come here and have set lesson plans for me to learn from the very beginning to now it's getting harder and harder and harder. You have to, in person, you have to say, well, slow down. You know, if you fingerspell it even instead of do the sign, then you are learning you're still learning the sign rather than communicating through the text when you don't understand. But the fact that she's right here, I have no doubt that I can do it.